Hey folks, hope you're having a great Monday. It's a beautiful looking day outside and I hope you can get outside for a little bit and enjoy the day. I want to talk to you again about some of the scriptures that are some of my favorites and I want to share from Revelation chapter 3 in verse 20. We, we hear Jesus telling us, here I am. I stand at the door and knock. And if anyone opens the door, I will come in and eat with him and he with me. For me, that's a great passage because it's a sign of intimacy that Jesus wants with us. And it's similar to kind of what we've been talking about in the last few days in, in the sermon on Sunday and in the devotional last Friday. And yesterday I spoke about the road to Emmaus in Luke chapter 24, beginning in verse 13, of the two disciples who were walking with Jesus and didn't even know he was there. And then on Friday in John chapter 19, when Jesus asked Peter for the third time, do you love me? And instead of using agape, he said, phileo, do you love me? Am I your friend? Do you count me as someone who is so important that I'm a friend? And what Jesus is asking Peter is, do you have this intimacy with me? And that's what I hear Jesus asking us today and telling us in Revelation 3.20. He says, I'm standing at the door. I'm knocking. Will you open the door? But when you open the door, he says, I'm going to come in and I'm going to eat with you. But he goes on. He, that would have been great just to have Jesus eat with us. But he goes on. He says, I'm going to eat with you. And you are going to eat with me. That is such a great sign of intimacy that we are able to have with Jesus. So as we draw closer to God, James tells us God is also drawing closer to us. So it's so important for us, especially during this time, to draw closer to God, to experience God, that when God is knocking, to open the door, to let God in, and to experience the power and the presence and the intimacy of God. Don't wait until you're retired or until the kids are older, or until you think, well, I think I have more time, because we'll fill that time up, or it could just be too late. Make sure to open that door to Jesus. He is always there. He is constantly waiting for us, wanting us to be in relationship with him. So friends, as you think about the passages we've been talking about, especially on Friday and again today, and what we talked about yesterday in worship, Jesus is knocking. And he wants in the worst way for you to open the door to him. Open the door, let him in and experience him and eat with him. He eats with you, you eat with him. That sounds good to me. Friends, have a great day. God bless you. See you soon. Goodbye.